Hello everyone, this is Universal Gaming and we have a special video for you guys today. We are going to be playing one of my favorite Mortal Kombat games to ever be released, and that is Mortal Kombat Shadow Monks released on the PlayStation 2 in 2005. This game is amazing. I've had so much fun playing this back when it first came out. So we're not going to waste any time, we're going to get right to it. We are going to be playing Scorpion. Of course, I beat the game, obviously. So, um, a little story. Back when um, in school, when I got out of school, me and my big brother, we used to um, go home, plug in the PS2, and we just play this nonstop. We get on co-op, and my brother plays Kung Lao, and I play Liu Kang. And then on versus mode, there will be times when um, I play Scorpion and Reptile, and Liu Kang, and my brother plays Sub-Zero, and Kung Lao, like they just be, it was just so much fun. They also have a demo of Suffering 2. I played it, it was pretty good, scary, might I add. Of course, Mortal Kombat 2, you guys know the history with that, not gonna get into that. But yeah, let's not waste any time, let's get to it. I'm gonna be playing Scorpion, no more difficulty. Hope you guys enjoy this amazing cutscene. At the first tournament, the forces of Earthrealm were facing their greatest challenge.
The amazing cutscene. And now, let's get straight to the stories, shall we? Chapter 1 Goro's Lair. Let me hush up and uh, let's listen to this. into the sea. Make your way to the Wuxi Academy. Pick up the items I've left behind for information. Alright. See if I remember some... If I remember, of course. Squares punch. Triangles kick, of course. Heavy attacks. And let's see. R2 throw. Alright. Got this. Normally, there would be... Normally, if I was playing Luke Kang, he would say, what are these creatures? But we're not playing Luke Kang, aren't we? No. We're playing Scorpion. The man that kicked ass in the new Mortal Kombat movie that came out this year. If you guys haven't seen it, I suggest you go see it. You might not regret it. If you have HBO Max, you're in for a treat. It's better than go buying a ticket, obviously, unless you prefer to see it on the big screen, which I did. Awesome. Of course, I'm not going to spoil, because there's going to be some people who haven't seen it, but hopefully, you know. But anyways, enough of that. Okay, he's done for. But yeah. This is going to be a fun story mode for me to play for you guys. Hopefully, those who are watching, feel free to hit that like and turn on notifications for more kick-ass gameplays. Retro and current. Burn. Oh, you thought you burned. But yeah. Now... Of course, didn't do it the first time. I definitely um, unlocked everyone here, did all the side missions for Smoke, obviously, so won't be doing on this gameplay because I've already done it, but I will definitely do bonus boss fights. I'll, hopefully, I'll be able to... I didn't remember how I fought Ermac, but I definitely know how to fight guys like Kano. So hopefully that's the case. I like doing that move. Gives me more damage, especially this. Get out of here. Now... After I play Mortal Kombat 2, I've been thinking maybe I can do a playthrough. I love this song. But yeah, I was thinking of doing a playthrough. Maybe um, once I'm finished with uh, this of Shalomux, which is going to probably be uh, 9, 10. There's going to be 10 parts of this video, or possibly 11 or 9. It depends how well this gameplay goes. It's not going to be a speed run, I can tell you that for sure. Get out of here. Yeah, 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 I know. Okay, watch 
You guys fight. I'll take care of this guy. Oh, and by the way, unlike, um... Unlike Liu Kang and, uh... Unfortunately, like Liu Kang and Kung Lao has more than just two fatalities. Scorpion and Sub-Zero, they have two fatalities only. Which is the classic of Mortal Kombat 2 fatalities. The spear where he rips his opponent in half and the classic skeleton skeleton you you know you guys know i don't have to explain myself you guys know Excellent. the favorite one is definitely uh his mortal of course the spear the scorpion spear yeah am i missing <laughs> air combat That's what you get. Come on. Caught him while he was in the air. He's done for. Oh, I like this part. Watch this. You guys want to see something cool? Grab that weapon. Can I get the sword? Thank you. Awesome. Also, also, Scorpion has one mutality and one brutality, of course. That was awesome. Oh, um, I, I said this before. I meant to finish it. I'm thinking once I was going to do a, a playthrough of this, once I was finished with the Shell Amongst, then maybe I'll do a, a Conquest mode for Deception. My decision, either I was going to do this or Deception or Conquest mode. Like, you guys have obviously seen me do, you know, a gameplay with the... Uh, okay, he's done for. thought I was going to get up, but no. But yeah. I was going to do either this or the Conquest Mode of Deception. Obviously, playing this was a lot of fun, obviously. One of the greatest Mortal Kombat games ever. It is another of Shang Tsung's servants. I do not serve Shang Tsung. We'll be fighting that guy soon. Probably not in this video, but on any other. That was cool. Oh, and guys, hopefully in this gameplay, Scorpion can go full gangster on these guys, because I don't know if you guys have noticed, but every time I do this, instead of saying, get over here, he just says, get over here, bitch. Get the fuck over here. Hopefully... In this on this um walkthrough, he'll be able to say it. That'll be so cool. Alright, let's get this guy out of here. By the way, Ed Boone, if you're watching this, which I highly doubt that you are, we're still waiting on that remaster. Either you remaster this amazing game or you make a sequel. Which you guys should have done instead of making that crappy 
DC Universe you guys made back in 2008. Some may have liked it. I'll admit back then as a kid I liked it, but then growing up... Hold on, let me be quiet. You now have the power. I now have the power to execute a fatality. Which means I'll be doing his first one, which is called Flame. I have to press up, up, down, down, square. But yeah, so back then as a kid, I may have liked the story, but at the same time, me growing up, I realized that how bad they tarnished the Mortal Kombat, like, you know, legacy. Knowing that Mortal Kombat was never going to be, you know, something a censored game when it comes to fatalities. Like the way they did Jack's fatality, you know, Luke Kang's, Scorpion's, okay, Scorpion's, his wasn't censored, never. But some of them were. Kano's, like what the hell? All right, let's look at this. Oh, and by the way, guys, hold on, wrong one. By the way, guys, when I have enough um, points, I'm going to try and uh, buy the combos, and I'm going to leave the specials alone, because the combos gives you more damage. Most definitely. When you think about it, combos are more effective than specials. Sometimes. My favorite boss fight of this game has definitely got to be, in my opinion, the man I'm playing right now, Scorpion. Like, his is definitely one of my favorites. Uh, Jesus Christ, get off my nuts! Get out of here! Get out of there. I'm gonna fuck them up real quick. More people coming? I'll definitely rough these guys up some more. No? Okay, moving on. Now we gotta fight this guy. But hopefully I can do it in a quick way and not so, you know, not bad. I'm not going to save that right now. Not yet. Oh, and by the way, try looking before jumping. Oh, really? You know what? I was going to do, and speaking of Mortal Kombat gameplays... I was gonna do Sub Zero mythologies. I changed my. I'm, there's no way. There's no way I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that because they didn't do something like that of making us look and see where the hell we're jumping. For all you guys that have played this in the past, you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. Without a scratch. Doing me. Time to do the second fatality. We call this the spear slice. Fatality. 
and you go over there. You now have the ability I now have the ability to long jump. Everyone's dead. So far, so good, but I'm sure I won't be saying that throughout the other gameplay videos as I be going. Especially when I fight the fucking Qatar Khans. Like, Jesus, I hate those guys. You'll see why. Let me go ahead and save this. Right. That doesn't look right. But again, this is originally for Liu Kang. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got a whole L2 to block, obviously. I can do this instead. Same with you. But, I'll rough you up. seen that before. A little horror kiwi, if you will. Alright. There goes that. Before I go any further, let me let me say my outro. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. There definitely will be a part... Well, come on. I'm not gonna stop there. See you guys on the next gameplay of Mortal Kombat Shadow Mux with Scorpion. I will see you guys on the next video. And I'm out. Long ago, in the magic realm of Outworld, Shao Kahn hungered for power, for strength, for all things dark and arcane. The blood he spilled in his brutal conquest of Outworld is impossible to measure or imagine, as was his hunger. Once all he could see was under his control, Shao Kahn turned his attention to Earth. But the Elder Gods had created a mystical tournament to protect Earth, known as Mortal Kombat. Shao Kahn could only lay claim to Earth if his champions were victorious in the tournament. Thus far, Earth's warriors have triumphed, saving Earth. But some fights only require a lone victory, and all can be lost with a single defeat. You have ensured peace for Earth once again this day. But there is no power in these medals apart from the knowledge you must carry into every battle. That no one is a champion alone. If one of us is in chains, none of us are free. If even one succeeds, the victory is ours. Liu Kang, you have defeated the sorcerer Shang Tsung. You have saved this realm as your forefathers did from his evil. You are Earthrealm's champion and hero. Thank you, Master Raiden. When next the tournament is fought, it will be my ancestors that are honored. Sonya Blade, you were a warrior before the tournament began, but here you have been tested and triumphed against enemies beyond Earth's measure. Thank you, Master Raiden. I know you have your chief officers to report to, but know that you will always have friends here and warriors willing to help you in your future missions. Sir. Johnny Cage. Lay it on me, Raiden. Bow, you idiot. Despite your natural shortcomings, you have proven yourself a valuable ally against Shang Tsung. You have the respect of myself and the Shaolin Order. Master. Ah, Kung Lao. 
Family honor is not won in a single day. It is won all the days of a life. It is won in fidelity and faithfulness. It is achieved through perseverance. There is not a warrior here that would have survived if you had not warned them of the traps in Goro's lair. Your family has been honored. Your friends honor you as well. For the moment you have earned rest, enjoy the peace you will find walking these grounds. Send them back to where they came from. Defend the Academy. 